Boom. <laughs> so hold on. Hey guys, good afternoon, good afternoon. Today I'm here with my little niece, Faith. We're here, we're coming live to you from Far Rockaway, New York. I'm gonna invite my brother, Bart, real quick so he can join us. Give me one second. Okay, Bart, I'm on. It's no doggy. Yes. It's one, two, three, four, five. Boom, Charles. Mm -hmm. <laughs> see, see, Charles is right there. Well, yeah. Charles, Charles is watching us. Can you believe it? Yes. Charles is watching us. Charles is right there. Martin is right there. Boom, Martin. Boom. I'm here with Faith. Faith, say hi. Say hi. Hi. Yes. A lot of people out there watching you right now. Can you believe it? We have 287 people watching us. Mm -hmm. Huh? Right? Okay. Hey guys, so I'm waiting on my brother Bart who is coming up shortly. Hey, we have a we have a, we have an amazing conversation going on today because we're really looking at what's what what are you committed to? You know, looking at your commitment, your level of your commitment. Because so many times people want to when you when you when you start up a business or you start up anything, you feel really excited. Hey, my brother, come on, man, come on. Okay, yeah, let me invite you. Let's do this. Okay. Now, hey, Peggy. Say hi, Peggy. Hi, Peggy. Yes, Peggy. Peggy is an amazing lady. She is growing the business. She is an amazing woman. You know, I mean, we're going to meet her someday, okay? Yes. Great. Okay, so we're adding Bart. Bart is going to come on live. Hey, Therese. Boom, hey, Faith. Boom, Rudy. Thank you, my brother, for taking hey, care of all of you. Hey, sweetheart. How are you? How are you? How are you? <laughs> Boss said he's fine. Fine. Great. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. What's going on, my brother? Hey, I, I tell you, I've got, I've got extra stuff coming in from somewhere. Uh, okay. <laughs> Whoa. Hang on, let me turn something hi, down in here and see if I can do how something. How are you? How are you? Hey, Dre. Dre, say hi, Fit. Say, say, how are you? How are you? Hi. Hi. Awesome. All right, we'll awesome. just keep going. I've got, I've got uh, feedback coming on, on my end, but hey, you know what? Yeah. You're talking about, about true commitment, and this is yes. true commitment. Absolutely. I mean, you, I mean, this is what you and I, you, you and I kind of spoke about in the morning. Right. You know, we're, we're looking about, we're talking about commitment. How committed are you? Hey, Carol, thanks for jumping on. <laughs> you know, it's, it's, it's amazing when you look at, when you really look at commitment, you know, because right. so many times we are committed when things, when things go right. We're right. committed when people say, uh, when people say, yeah, when people join an, an opportunity, they're committed. Mm -hmm. You know, right. they, but but at some point that commitment kind of dies out. The yes. commitment kind of kind of dies out. You know, and I, it's it's awesome because it's awesome because now when everything every time you every time you 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 hit it you hit a roadblock, right? Right. Every time you hit it you hit a roadblock. That's when the commitment. That's when the commitment really comes in because that's when you really want to know how committed you are or how <laughs> committed anybody is because at some point people are gonna fail. At some point, when people start up or something, then right. they hit a roadblock, they'll be like, oh, my God, I didn't make it. Oh, my God, I'm not making money in this thing. Oh, my God, this right. is not working out for me. Oh, my right. God, this and this is not working out. But you really, you really, if you want to take a look at yourself, you want mm -hmm. to look at how committed you are, how committed you are in, in, in your business. Hey, Kelly, say hi to Kelly. <laughs> 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 yeah, man, yeah. I mean, looking uh, at that commitment, what do you think? Well, you're exactly right. In fact, I was chatting with someone this morning and the negativity that she faces from people who she tells about this opportunity, it's just, it, 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 really, it really interferes and it really right. causes you to, to question and test your own commitment. Right. But it's, it's like what HB said this weekend. Instead of asking, instead of asking how do I, you ask what, what if. if. Absolutely. You just ask what if. 
Absolutely. I mean, talking about what if I know you and I, you and I break the record yesterday. We yeah. had so many people calling us and jumping on and say, hey, guys, I saw you guys doing the news media on Times Square. <laughs> right. <laughs> it was crazy. We were celebrities yesterday. <laughs> absolutely. Absolutely. You know, I, I'm, I'm looking at I'm looking at what Therese just said. Therese, Therese said, <laughs> hey, Woody, you feel the first rule of media hosting. Your co-host is not more beautiful than you. <laughs> <laughs> You know, but it, it's all about, it goes down to our commitment. Right. I know you and I, you and I spoke about mm -hmm. strategies. I mean, before we even started doing this Facebook Live, we never sat down to talk about anything. We never sat down to strategize. We never sat down to plan everything. But right. it, it all boils down to the commitment. How committed we've been. How committed right. we've been. Look, look at you right now at the airport. You are committed and you say, man, I'm going to do this. Whatever, whatever right. it takes, we're going to be on live out here because we have so many people out there who look, who look up to you know they look up to all this information that we keep giving out there absolutely absolutely you know and and and, and commitment begins with making a commitment to yourself and right. it's like you and i talked about for what four or five hours yesterday about yes. strategizing you know yes. and how committed are we and sometimes things get in the way of that commitment but you right. learn to work around it absolutely absolutely you know carol carol just said when you hit those roadblocks that's when you get help from your offline. Exactly. exactly, exactly. Because so many times we really think about it to be like, oh, everything is on me. Everything right. is on me, you know. But we have a support. I sent out a, I sent out a group message um, last night to my, you know, to my team. I said, hey guys, you are in business for your, you are in business, but you are not in business for yourself. Hey, right. Ever, thanks for jumping on. Say hi. Hey, Ever. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you're in business, but you're not in business for yourself because you have all these team members there out there. Right. We're out there right. to support you. We're out there yep. with all our friends, like family. We've, been, we've, we've just become like a, like a whole family. Absolutely. And, and it, if someone says, you know what, my, my, my upline's not very involved, that's your indication to look above that person and keep looking right. up and keep looking up. What did, what did Karen and Peter Hirsch say to you and me uh, Saturday oh night? God. Oh my God. I mean, those, these, I mean, these are amazing people. And they said, yeah. you know what? This is my number. Call me anytime. Yes. Can you, can they you imagine? Are these, are, these are million dollar earners. And right. they are literally giving up their phone numbers to us to call them anytime that we right. need. Ex anytime look, that we need help. Look at Mr. Ronnell Sylvester. Where would you or I be without him? And he's way Absolutely. up the upline. You know? He's way up there. I mean, but, yeah. but he, he, this, I mean, this is how somebody kind of put themselves down. This how right. something people really say, you know what, I'm, I, I am here because of my team and I'm right. here to support them. Whatever it takes for me to get to, you know, give them the help that they need, I'm right. here to give them that help, you know. Absolutely. And, and people will feel, you, you feel like at some point, you, you know, the excitement will be there. You mm -hmm. feel like, hey, I just want to get in the business. I just want to start the excitement is there. At some point, you, right. I just, at some point you hit a roadblock, I'd be like, oh my God, I, I'm not making anything. You know, well, but you really want to look at how committed have you been in the business? Right, because right. if you if you really evaluate yourself, you know, one of the things that I know you and I have spoken about here, and it's like, can you hire yourself? Exactly, you and know? can you fire yourself? <laughs> can you fire yourself? <laughs> <laughs> because if 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 you if you're actually going to apply for a job, if you're right. applying for a job to your own company, and right. you and the way you are, the way you are being, the way you are acting with this business, can you really? Say to yourself, I am going to hire myself to work the same in this trend. If not, then it's time for you to fire yourself and reinvent that commitment because we have less than 60 days to the end of 2019. That's exactly right. You're exactly right. You know, today is what, November the 4th. Yes. And you, if you're here in the U.S., you've got to figure out, well, you know what, you've got Thanksgiving coming up. There Absolutely. may be a few days there where you do commit totally to your family as you should. Right. Right. But that commitment doesn't mean you're not committed to your business and what else Absolutely. you're doing. Absolutely. So you just keep that commitment piece going. You know, uh, uh, this morning I, I took an Uber up here uh, right. and, you know, it wasn't what I wanted to do, but I, I was committed. I was going to make it happen. Took an Uber up here to the airport. And yet this gentleman and I had a wonderful conversation, gave him an iBoomerang, told him Look about Vibrite. And yeah. he said to me, he said, I don't speak Spanish very well. I mean, I speak English very well. I speak Spanish. Right. And I said, no problem. All of our stuff is in Spanish. <laughs> and he said, for real? I said, yeah, all of our stuff is in Spanish. Isn't I said, as, awesome? a, as a Vibride driver, you can request a Spanish-speaking driver. Correct. And he was like, wow. Right. I've never heard of that before. I said, Absolutely. it's coming soon. <laughs> Absolutely. I mean, look, look at what, I mean, that's what even 
people are looking at the technology. Oh my right. God, my baby is sleeping. And it's going to sleep. <laughs> I'm right there with faith. I'm right there with faith, I tell you. People are, people are looking at the technology. People are looking at the, you know, the, the momentum that's going on. Because right. the, look at what we did. Look at what we did out there. Hey, Auntie Yvonne said, hi. <laughs> you know, people are looking at the technology. They're mm. looking at the energy. They're looking at the momentum, like what we keep doing. You know, right. and they, and they are excited. Look at the look at those those friends that the, the new friends that we created in Times Square oh yesterday. God. That family, they were just looking at us and like, oh my God, what are you guys doing? You know, right. because the momentum is there, and they really want to be part of it. They Absolutely. really want to be part of it. That's what it is. I mean, we, we had a number of people that were filming us being you know, doing our, exactly. our thing live because they weren't exactly. sure what it was. They knew it was something different and something special. And that one yes. gal, that young lady that came on and waved at everybody. That was just yes. amazing. That was amazing. Absolutely. Absolutely. Hey, man, we just really love the, you know, that we were, love what we, what, what we keep doing. I know you're right. out there at the airport, your flight's about to take off. And, mm -hmm. we, you know, I love the fact that we really gave this commitment because somebody needed to be, you see, somebody needed to know how, right. committed, how committed they should be in, in right. order for them to be, you know, in order for them to be determined about their success. Mm -hmm. Because your success is not going to come. Somebody's not going to love your success more than the way you do. Exactly. You know, exactly. So I'm not. We, we know. I mean, we as coaches, we as leaders, we're struggling. We're helping other people out there to grow. But yeah. you're gonna have to show. You're gonna have to show up. You're gonna have to step up. You're gonna right. have to give somebody motivation. Give right. them the reasons to motivate you. Give them Absolutely. the reason to help you. you Absolutely. Know? Absolutely. You know, um, you talk about about commitment. One of the things, guys, coming up, you and I have some plans for how this program itself is going to oh go to God. another level. I mean, oh we're committed God. to saying, you know what, we've done this now for what, I don't know, 60, 90 days. I have no idea right. how long we've been doing right. this. Right. But we've got plans for some new and different things. And we even said, well, what if so-and-so exactly. could be a guest? What, what if, if? so-and-so could be a guest? So, guys, Absolutely. stay tuned because it's going to get crazy between now and Christmas. Absolutely. Yeah, you, you just have to now at Christmas. That's amazing. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, man. For somebody who, who is out there, maybe their first time checking our video, right. and they, 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 they're just checking, like, hey, what, what is the guy really talking about? You know, I've mm -hmm. been seeing them doing their videos, but I really don't know what they're talking about. Go for it, man. Man, but I, I boomerang. The, the best description I can give you is we are a proprietary technology company that has Uber technology and an Amazon philosophy. If you right. want to know more than that, just, just put in the comments and yours or mine or anybody sharing this. Tell me more and we will tell you what this is. If you just want to check out this technology and right. see how you can save on travel, on lifestyle activities, coming soon, ride share and a cellular service, just right. put ME and we'll send you one. I mean, we were going about right and left in Times Square. Charles, <laughs> Charles just said something. What's, what's next, iBoom Cable? I can't wait for that to show. <laughs> <laughs> you know, exactly. What, what, what's next? I mean, we don't know, but this I thing mean, we do know is that Mr. Holton Bugs and Edmund Haynes and, and Mark Kitkart, T. Gray, Peter Hirsch, David Manning, that whole executive group, right. they've got a vision that we can't even begin to realize what their dreams are. But well, we're going to realize mean, their dreams. And I really, I'm just super excited, super fired up about us being the first movers. You know, having a conversation the other day with this lady and she said, I said, hey, we are the first movers of her. I'm like, have you ever been in a position where you are being one of the first people to, right. to experience a movement that's right. going to change the world? I Absolutely. Mean, look, look at Mr. Johnny, man. This, I, mean, I, 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 mean, oh I don't even want us to start talking about what I this know. guy did and what, what he just brought to this album because he just brought a new kind of energy a, a new a, kind of absolutely. energy he's bringing a whole crew from a whole nother business into a boomerang because he says you know what i am putting my family's future into a boomerang because i know this mm. is what is going I, this, this this thing this mm. thing is gonna it's gonna explode and he really sure. want to be part of it absolutely and uh, if you think about if you knew today what you knew seven years ago about uber and had the opportunity to be part of Uber, would you have done it? Absolutely. That's where we are. And some of the things Mr. Holtenbug shared with us Saturday, being at the very beginning, it's going to be crazy what we're going to be able to, to, be able to, to achieve. Right. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Hey, man, I love what we keep doing. We keep helping Me folks too, man. out there. For anybody who is watching this, you know, if somebody sends this out to you, 
go back to them, ask them for more information. And if you're watching this on any of our pages, Bart's Facebook page, my Facebook mm -hmm. page, you know, like Bart said, go in there and you know, put on the comment, tell me more. Or you can just, right. say, just say me and we're going to reach back to you and, you know, contact you and let you know what's going on, this new technology that's going right. to change the world. You know, until then, my brother, have a safe flight. I boom, can't wait my to brother. catch up with you tomorrow. I cannot right? wait. And thank everyone for joining us. <laughs> boom to you. Have a boomtastic day, my people. You too, man. Boom. Bye.